Ransomware is one of the biggest concerns we see, and for good reason because of how costly and damaging these types of attacks can be. Ransomware also has the unfortunate characteristics of being both highly destructive and increasingly common. We need to mature our security capabilities to be able to prevent these advanced attacks like ransomware. But a challenge we're seeing is how can we secure such distributed and complex environments? VMware security is able to block threat actors across the distributed attack surface comprised of the network, endpoint, and identity. In this light board, we'll be running through a ransomware attack and seeing how VMware security solutions can prevent threat actors and modern advanced threats all across the attack surface. So let's walk through an attack. Most adversarial threats, like ransomware, will follow a multi-staged attack approach. In the initial step of this approach, the attacker will try and gain initial access or infiltrate network to launch the rest of their attack. Let's consider the case where a threat actor might send something like a uh, phishing email over to a remote end user. That email prompts the end user to download an unknown, an unknown to the end user, malicious application. We can prevent that malicious application from being downloaded with VMware Security Secure Access. We can block the download of unapproved and unknown applications on that endpoint. Let's consider the fact that maybe the attacker did infiltrate our environment. They've gotten through, they're gonna move on to the next stage of which they'll try and maintain that access that they currently have and manipulate it. So they'll wanna move laterally across the environment to those other endpoints of interest. The attacker is going to aim to maintain their current access and manipulate it. So escalate their privileges and move laterally across the environment into those endpoints that are higher target value. Something like the crown jewels of the environment. This could be a database or something else in this case. Even if the attacker has that initial access to the environment and can see all of our network nodes, we can prevent them from moving laterally in that environment. We're able to secure that east-west traffic uh, with a stateful layer step and firewall and segment that environment so that they aren't able to move anywhere in the environment freely, even if they do have that initial access. The final attack stages are execution and exfiltration. We've talked a little bit about how we can prevent at earlier attack stages, but let's look at how we can prevent those end goals of an attacker. So again, let's imagine here that we haven't prevented during that initial phase where they are trying to get access. We haven't prevented when they are trying to move laterally to that high target value endpoint. And we're at the point where they've reached our crown jewels and they're going to encrypt our data. We can prevent ransomware across a variety of different methods. If we know that it's something that's known bad, we've seen it before, we know it's a known bad piece of ransomware, we can apply prevention to it by knowing that bad binary. We can actually drop the traffic as well. Uh, we can also see if maybe the attacker is a, a bit more advanced and, and they're, they're using a piece of ransomware that we haven't seen before or is unknown. We can see those behaviors that are commonly associated with ransomware Things like encrypting data, accessing the master boot record, or deleting or modifying your volume shadow copies, we can see those ransomware-like behaviors and still apply prevention to it even if we haven't seen it before. Again, let's imagine here that the attacker has gone through all these steps. They've encrypted our data. We're at the point where we need to recover what was lost. VMware Security Solutions have disaster recovery capabilities where we can go back to a good state and we can do that in a really easy way by creating disaster recovery plans that can automate much of the activities that you'd have to do. We can also investigate uh, the network and endpoint event data to see when the point that we need to roll back to is where we are not going to still have that compromise. Even with DR, it's important that we have the capabilities to stop this attack before it occurs. Um, an increasingly common tacti tactic that we're seeing with ransomware is double extortion, where the attacker, once they reach the crown jewels, will try and exfiltrate data outside to something like a command and control server. We can prevent that from occurring. Uh, VMware Security is actually able to stop this with our distributed firewalls. And again, securing that east-west traffic so that people aren't able to move outside the environment with that important data. 
So we've covered just a few of the capabilities VMware Security is able to offer in our example of a ransomware attack. Uh, stay tuned for additional videos that will highlight the specific uh, capabilities of the various solutions that comprise VMware Security and a greater understanding of how we can prevent advanced threats like ransomware and secure the distributed attack surface. Thank you.